derivative of f of x. f of x is as follows. x to the third minus 3x squared plus 4 divided by x squared. So if you can find the derivative of this, then go ahead and divide each uh, term by x squared. So x to the third divided by x squared minus 3x squared divided by x squared plus 4 divided by x squared. So it's going to equal x, right, to the first power, minus 3, right, plus 4 times 1 over x squared. So that's going to be x to the first minus 3 plus 4 over x squared. So, so if you find the derivative with respect to x, it's going to be the derivative with respect to x of x to the first power minus the derivative with respect to x of 3 plus the derivative with respect to x of 4 um, times x to the negative second power. And just find the derivative um, using the power rule. Power rule is the derivative with respect to x. If x to the n power is going to be n times x to the n minus 1. So now it's going to be 1 times x to the 1 minus 1 minus the derivative of constant. Yeah, derivative. You know, we find any derivative of constant. You're going to notice the derivative with respect to x to c is going to be 0. It's going to be 0. Plus the derivative of 4 times the derivative of x to the negative second power f prime of x equals x to the zero power minus zero plus four times um use the power rule right here. Right? And then what you'll get is negative two x to the negative two minus one. F prime of x equals x to 0 power is 1, minus 0, plus 4 times negative 2 is negative 8. x to negative 2 minus 1 is negative 3. So x prime of x is equal to 1 minus 0, which is going to be 1, plus negative 8. x to negative 3 is so negative 8. x to negative 3. You write this so that way there's positive exponents. So the f prime of x equals 1 minus 8 divided by x to the third. 